Hey guys, so obviously I'm known for doing my get ready me's on TikTok. So I thought, why not do an in-depth get ready with me on YouTube? So I'm gonna do my hair, stick my lashes on, do my skincare and my makeup. Yeah, because on my get ready me's on TikTok, I just do like my makeup. So I usually already have my lashes on and my hair's done. But I thought, why not show you like the before stages as well, if that makes sense? I don't really like the lighting right now, but because of the time of day it is, the lighting doesn't get much better than this. So I'm going to have to roll with it. Um, anyways, so all I have in my hair is I sprayed some water on it. And put the Garnier hair mask in it and brushed it through with my demo brush. But I'm going to do the hairstyle that I literally do like every day. Um, where I have like two bits slicked down and then the rest of my hair out. So what this is like a little hair tutorial. Um, so I just get a front piece. I have to try and make it like even on both sides. So like that. And then I need to get a hairband. Just like this. And I tie the rest of my hair up. To make sure it's like very out of the way, I claw clip it as well. We're going to ignore this claw clip. It literally broke. So now it's like half of a claw clip. But oh well. Right, then with my front strands. On, I think it was my last YouTube video if you haven't seen it already. This is my eco gel. I, I said about how I have gummy gel mixed with it. But yeah, that's what gel I use. Um, so now I'm going to just... So I have this brush. I sometimes brush my hair with it. And then I get some of the gel. Put it in my hair. This is my like slick brush, as I call it. Um, and then just slick my hair down. like that see i'm just going to do the same to this side once i've slicked both of them down i tie it at the back like a little ponytail with my hair bubble i'll turn around i don't know if you can actually see it or not but i tie it quite a lot i don't know why but once i'm done i just like tighten it so there's like a tiny little ponytail the back of my hair once that's done, I let my hair down and it's basically done, but me always being extra, I spray more water on it, brush it again, because it, it does get naughty literally from that. Let me quickly do the same to this side. And then I sometimes apply more product, but right now I don't actually need it. I think it's all right like that. So yeah, that's my hair done. Before I move on to my makeup and skincare, I'm going to show you my outfit. So this is the top. It's like orange spray painted. Good duck down. That's the back. And then these orange leggings. It's a set from Miss Runway. Right, I haven't actually like cleansed my face yet or anything. So I'm going to spray it with water. Oh my God. So now I'm actually going to do my lashes. Um, I've got so many. I don't know which ones to do today. I'm only going to go with BQ Lash, my favorite. So, I need to find everything. I might do like a mini lash tutorial right now. So, these are the lashes. They're the 40D mix from BQ Lashes. Um, and then the set comes with their lash and, lash and bond? Bond and seal. Um, and then these are just my own tweezers. So, right, I'm going to move the camera up. I just apply the bond to the bottom of my lashes, like mascara kind of, but not all the way to the top of my lashes. Um, oh God. Okay, so I'll just tack on the first lash. I'm going to just keep applying them. People often ask for lash tutorials, but to be honest, I don't know whether it's just like I'm good at them, but... There's not much I do, I literally just go. And then it's on. So it's like, I don't know. That one went terribly, because it's actually poking my eye. But, hold on. Right, I've moved you guys over here. But once I've finished the lashes, I just get the seal side and just seal it. I just put it on the same way that I put on the bond. Right, so I'm just going to 
do this side and I'll be back. Okay, so I just finished my lashes. I don't know why today look really weird, but I now need to move on with everything else. So mainly all my skincare is Glow Recipe. First thing I'm gonna use is my Glow Recipe Face Mist. Next is the Glow Recipe Toner. This is actually really good. I actually do recommend it. Everyone on TikTok has it for a reason. I think the Glow Recipe Face Mist is really good, but if you're not up for spending loads of money on it, don't have to get it because it's kind of just like any other face mist. Okay, then moisturizer, I use the Glow Recipe Plump Plump Cream. I really like this and it has hyaluronic acid in it. Uh, and it smells so nice. It literally smells like, I don't know, like sweets kind of, but I love the smell of that. And then the matching like Glow Recipe Gloss Balm also smells like sweets and that's what I'm going to use now. I love this. It stays on my lips for a long time, which I love. Okay, so that is my skincare done. And I don't always like do my brows. Most of the time I brush them up with a spoolie. That's just what I'm going to do today. I don't know, I just don't really feel the need to do them that much anymore. I don't know why. Okay, so for my base, I use the Elf Halo Glow. This is in shade 5. And then I just use a Beauty Blender to blend this out. Okay, I finished blending that out. And I actually am in a rush today, guys, because I've been finally coming over in, like, 20 minutes. So, yeah, that's why I'm trying to speed the process. Process? I don't even know. But anyways, now I'm going to use my Pink Honey BFF Face Frosting. This is a really good bronzer. I really like it. And I have this in shade Hot Cocoa. I literally just guessed a random shade when I was buying it off TikTok shop. And luckily, I got like the perfect shade. So that's good. And I'm going to use my like, Made by Mitchell blush. And I'm going to use it in Can't Cope with Coral today. Look how nice that colour is. And then... I blend it out with my Maybelline Mitchell makeup brush. This makeup brush I've got, has got so many different blush shades on it. It's kind of turned my blush pink today, but it still looks nice, so I don't really care. Oh my god, my camera. I think you guys are fixed. There we go. Um, okay, now I'm going to use the W7 Sheer Loose Powder. I'll just use this powder puff from TikTok Shop. Right, and then I swipe it away with a different Made by Mitchell makeup brush. Okay, now that is my makeup finish. Last thing I'm gonna do is spray my Charlotte Tilbury setting spray. I love this setting spray, it is really good. Right, and then I'm gonna spray my 62 Solde Genero. Right, and that is the end of my in-depth get ready with me. Make sure you comment down below if you want more of these because I can easily do them. Yeah, I hope you guys enjoyed. If you did, like and subscribe. Bye, guys.